Hello everyone and welcome to our YouTube channel. This video will be a tutorial on Stripe payment. Stripe is an excellent alternative to PayPal for managing your online payments. So whether you're looking to save on fees or expand your payment options, Stripe offers a robust solution for businesses of all sizes. And in this video, I'm going to walk you through the process of setting up your Stripe account from checking country availability to creating your first payment link. So by the end of this video, you will have a clear understanding of how to leverage Stripe's features to streamline your payment processes and grow your business. So the very first step would be to check for Stripe availability. It's crucial to ensure that Stripe is available in your country. So I'm going to start by visiting the Stripe website and then checking their global availability list. Of course, this step is essential as Stripe services may vary depending on your location. So for that, go ahead and Google Stripe's country availability. And if you see your country listed, you're good to go. Once you have the availability confirmed, let's move on to setting up your account. So head over to stripe.com. And then from here, we want to start by creating an account. So navigate to the start now button, and that will take you to the account creation process. The sign up process is simple and straightforward. All you have to do is enter your email, select your country and choose a password. After filling in these details, create your account and verify your email address. Once that is done, you will gain access to your Stripe dashboard. This is where you will manage all aspects of your payment processing. The dashboard provides an overview of your account, including your current balance and any recent transactions. So one of the very first things that you will have to do once you're onto this dashboard is you want to activate your payments. So go ahead and click on the button just like this. And then from here, you will be taken through a step-by-step -step process in order to activate your payments, starting by entering your business location and other business details such as the illegal business name and the company registration number. The next crucial step for activating your payments would be to add your bank account for payouts. And to do that, all you have to do is simply enter your IBAN and to confirm it. Once you've entered all the necessary details, you will have to wait for the review. And if you got approved and your payments got activated, then all you have to do to generate a payment is head over to the payment section and then choose the type of payment that you would like to set up. So one of the easy options is to create a payment link. You can also manually charge a customer by creating a payment, send an invoice to your customer or use a pre-built payment form, just like the ones you would see on the e-commerce stores. However, this last option does require a code and it is more complex than the others. The most basic option would be to create a payment link and simply share that link to a checkout page. So I'm gonna go ahead and set one up for myself. You simply click on create a payment link and then from here you select the type of payment that you want to do so for example a product or subscription some stores or sellers offer the option to make the customer choose what they pay and this kind of thing is most popular with donations etc you can also choose to collect customers addresses require customers to provide a phone number or limit the number of payments so go ahead and click the drop down menu from the product in order to add one Add the name for your product, a small description, specify whether it's a one-off kind of payment or a recurring subscription, and of course, add the amount to be paid. So let's say my product is for example $50, you can add any images if you would like to in order to showcase what the product would look like into the checkout page. And once everything is complete, simply click on add product. You can double check the checkout page, see how it looks like for the customer. And if everything looks good, then simply click on create a link at the top right corner. And once your link is created, you can share it directly with customers or integrate it into your website. And that in essence is our tutorial on how you can set up and use Stripe for your payment needs. From creating your account, generating payment links and integrating them into your website, you now have the foundational knowledge to start accepting payments through Stripe. Thank you for watching this video. Let us know whether you have any other questions by leaving them in the comment section down below. And if you found today's video to be helpful or informative to watch, then go ahead and give us a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you don't miss out on any follow-up content that we can make related to this one.